So I'm on the premises of the Takebayashi Museum of Art, uh, founded by the Guma Prefecture. And as you can see, this is a really beautiful architecture. And um, you know, you might not know it, but actually, uh, Japan is a great uh, museum nation. There are many beautiful uh, museums, and this one I think is uh, focused on the contemporary arts. And as you can see, the architecture itself is quite wonderful. Um, I think it has received some prizes, and although it's closed today, so there are no people around here, it would be great to visit this art museum uh, if you are near Tatebayashi. Uh, you, probably you haven't heard about Tatebayashi, but there are many wonderful uh, Satonuma poems, and, uh, which I covered in my other YouTube videos. So this is the apotheosis of Japanese Zen spirit, I think, you know, so simple, not simplistic, but deeply simple. Uh, you know, Andy Warhol famously said that he was a deeply superficial person. Uh, this is a deeply Zen place uh, to visit and uh, the simplest, the really simple uh, forms and the beauty, elegance and, um, you know, subdued presentation of what beauty is all about is a great hallmark of this art museum. So make it one of your destinations in Japan, the Tatebayashi Museum of Art, and you won't be disappointed. There are wonderful natural habitat just nearby. It's actually in the great nature, the great Satoyama nature of Tatebayashi. Uh, Satoyama is this idea that you can uh, achieve harmony between uh, the nature and uh, uh, artificial activities and uh, uh, really beautifully expressed in the Japanese concept of uh, uh, Nagomi, uh, which is a subject of my book. Um, you know, this is quite Nagomi, uh, this art, artificial uh, structure and the great nature. There's such a Nagomi between that nature and the art museum. And it makes it such a really special place to visit. That Hatsibayashi Museum of Art. So, uh, I hope you can make it. I have made it today. For the first time, actually.